60,000. 60,000? Saying the number twice doesn't double it, you know. You're gonna have to add another zero. Really? Okay. Let's see. 60,000 plus zero equals, wait, 60,000. Uh, what about 80? <sighs> no. What is that, like an organ or something? My cell phone plays Ode to Joy, but it's on vibrate. What? Three law degrees and all you guys can talk about is organ music and ringtones? Look, the only reason I came here today was because I thought Butel was interested in finally doing the right thing. Miss Keller, your case was adjudicated by the vaccine court. and They determined our client's vaccine didn't cause your son's autism. Wow, except for client, son, and autism, just about every word in that sentence was wrong. First, it wasn't your client's vaccine. It was a preservative in it. It wasn't a court. It was a procedural hoop I had to jump through in order to get here. And they didn't say your client's vaccine didn't cause my son's autism. They only said I couldn't prove it. You still can't. No credible scientist and no repeatable study has been able to prove a causal connection between mercuritol and autism. Then why is Butel the only vaccine manufacturer who still uses it? You really want to find out? Lobby Butel's board to make you the CEO. You've got about as much chance of doing that as you do of winning this at trial. It would still be a trial, Mr. Dowd, and even if the jury doesn't believe me, maybe everybody reading about the trial will. And maybe they'll make sure not to use your client's product to vaccinate their kids. And maybe, just maybe, your client's stockholders will order Butel to take the product off the market. Miss Keller, you know the first thing I learned about litigation? Clients won't know if you pad the bill. <sighs> okay, the second thing. Litigation is only about what you can prove in a court of law. Now, we can offer you $90,000. I sincerely recommend you take it and get on with your life. Ninety's good. 